What's up guys? Welcome to Inspire to Cook. Have you seen those cool chocolate decorated things that you can actually eat? Well, what if it was so easy to do that you could actually do it at home? Today I'm gonna show you how to make super cool, super easy to make and very beautiful chocolate basket. Edible chocolate basket. We're gonna need some chocolate chips as well as a microwave safe bowl, a Ziploc bag, small balloon, as well as an aluminum foil and a plate to put it on. First thing I'm gonna do is I'm gonna grab some aluminum foil and put it right on top of my plate so we have it ready when everything else is coming into place. There we go, just like that. Then we're gonna grab our balloon and blow it up just a little bit. About this size is enough. I'm gonna tie it up and rinse it off really well in the water. Then we're gonna grab our chocolate chips and take it to our microwave. We're gonna put it in the microwave for 30 seconds then mix it up and put it in again for 30 seconds until it's completely melted. Our chocolate is nice and melted, so we're gonna transfer it into our Ziploc bag. We're gonna turn these corners just like that, put it right into your hand, and we're gonna start putting chocolate right into it. This way when we're done, the outside of the bag is not dirty. There we have it, all the chocolate is in. We're gonna go ahead and close the Ziploc bag in. And we're gonna let all the air out on the top corner. So now that our Ziploc bag is ready, we're gonna leave it alone. We're gonna grab our balloon and we're gonna go ahead and put some spray oil on it. And we're gonna rub it in to make sure it covers all the surface. If you don't have spray oil, you can use regular oil, just rub it in onto the balloon. And grab our Ziploc bag and cut a small, very small hole on one corner of it. We're gonna grab the balloon, flip it upside down, and we're gonna start drawing circles in it. Just like that. We're gonna make sure the circles are overlapping and then we're gonna make long circles along this side just like that and we're gonna place it in our foil and we're gonna do the same with the other balloon we're gonna make this one much smaller because our chocolate is running out You can put the rest to the base so it's nice and flat when you set it up. I have a little bit of a chocolate left so I'm gonna put it to good use. And it's time to put it in our refrigerator. After about an hour and a half in the fridge, I think it's all set. So we're gonna go ahead and remove the balloons. You don't want them to pop super quick, so we're gonna go ahead and stretch it out right at the top and make a small hole. Just like that. And slowly, very slowly, let the air out. There you go. These chocolate balls look amazing, and if you put those uh, strawberry flowers in them, that will just complete the look. You can find out how to make these strawberry flowers in the previous video. We made them for the Mother's Day. We'll spread out the strawberry petals just like that. And when you lay it out on a nice white plate, it looks amazing. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Do those lovely chocolate baskets for your loved ones. We'll see you next time. <laughs> Whoa, finally you came back. What is that? <laughs> he was hitting me. <laughs> The taste of dark chocolate. Push it.